Right. Uh, I uh, like to go around all the mosques in the constituency just to make clear that I'm here to represent you and any issues or concerns or problems that you want to bring to me, then you should feel free to do so. Um, beyond that, uh, particularly during the holy month of Ramadan and as we look ahead towards Eid, uh, I want to again stress just how important the Muslim community is to life here in Scotland. You make Scotland a better country than we would be without the Muslim community and your contribution is hugely appreciated uh, to making the country uh, more diverse uh, and stronger than we would be otherwise. So thank you for uh, giving me such a welcome this afternoon and to repeat, any time you need my help with anything, any time you need uh, somebody to uh, raise issues or concerns with, then that's what I'm here to do, uh, to be your representative and please uh, always feel free to come and see me at any time you want. Thank you very much for your hospitality. Nicola, today. can you just elaborate on your referendum a little bit more? Um, I hope that we can have a referendum uh, next year um, in order that people in Scotland, I should say I appreciate there uh, will be different views on whether Scotland should be independent or not. Uh, you might have noticed I believe Scotland should be an independent country. Yeah, uh, yeah. That would be one way of making sure we can stay open to people from all over the world to come here and uh, make Scotland their home. Uh, but I think it's all the more important that we have a choice over that now because we face being taken out of the European Union when we didn't want that and we might be facing the prospect 